I used to tell people that the government pays me to blow things up, and then they used to ask, are you in the NSA or the FBI or something like that? And I said, no, I teach science. Sidereel sat down with one of the producers of American Teacher, Nineveh Caligari. In 2003, Dave Eggers, Daniel Maltrop, and I started doing research uh, around this thesis. What would happen if we paid teachers more? And doesn't everyone agree that good teachers deserve to have a legitimate salary? And so after my classroom experience, I worked on the book, and we interviewed hundreds of teachers around the country for a book called Teachers Have It Easy, which is a tongue-in-cheek title. And we heard from teachers about their successes and their challenges, and we heard that they all had stories about how they felt undervalued in the society at large. I leave the house at 7 o'clock in the morning, and I get here at 7.45. My first student arrives at 8 o'clock from 8 to 8.30, and I assess him or her um, with a one-on-one -on -one assessment. And then this whole class comes at 8.30, School ends at 2.50, and I tutor from 3.30 to 5.30, and I get home at 6.30. Vanessa, our director, did an incredibly beautiful job weaving these four compelling stories together of our four lead characters, and I think that those four characters do very well represent the experiences of the 3.2 million teachers. I do very much feel that the characters represent my personal story, having been a classroom teacher for almost a decade, and I'm hearing loud and clear from teachers that they feel moved by the story, and they feel like it's an authentic representation of what they're facing. And we're the only film that really takes the education topic from the teacher's perspective and really asks them um, about their challenges, struggles, and lives. Given the low pay and long hours, teachers burn out at a rate unparalleled in almost any other field. I feel like I give everything I have, but it's never enough. As the man, you're supposed to be the provider. When you can't provide for your family, you, you feel like a loser. 92% of teachers buy their own supplies, 62 have jobs outside of the classroom. People assume that they understand the teaching profession when they don't necessarily have an insider knowledge of what it's like to be a teacher. And so I think we need to focus on keeping good teachers in by improving conditions and we need to improve their salary so they can afford to stay. We need to give them the respect that they deserve and the way that we're going to respect them is by giving them the power to be able to make decisions. And we need to create a professional ladder so that teachers can change their responsibilities and grow within a profession like every other profession. And then we need to make sure that principals are incredibly well informed and are very, very good masters at teaching and learning so that they can be good leaders in their schools. In America, 46% of teachers quit before their fifth year. My son just graduated from college this year and he's making way more selling cell phones for Verizon than he ever could as a teacher. We, we set out to make a funny movie and it's not a very funny topic, but we did want Americans to just have to slap their knees at how, how silly some of the stuff was and you do see that some people really do find the absurdities pretty hilarious. So hopefully people will come see it so they can have that experience. There are currently 3.2 million public school teachers in the United States. In the next 10 years, 1.8 million of them will be eligible for retirement. Who will replace them? Having a teacher that's, that you can trust, you know, that will change lives.